The uniform is crisp, the brass is polished, for this is an afternoon when only the white glove treatment will do. U.S. Air Force veteran Larry Dupree is one of only 300 Honor Guard musicians certified to play taps as America lays its servicemen to rest. I always say the last name of the veteran before I do the first note of taps. To me, that's a little bit of closure. It kind of uh, brings the whole circle back together again. The haunting tune is 24 notes long. A simple line of music that lasts only a matter of seconds, but its impact lasts a lifetime. The melancholy melody first signaled the day is done at Civil War camps. This 150-year-old tradition can't keep up with the reality of a thousand military burials every day. So about a decade ago, the Department of Defense approved the use of digital recordings. There are some, some really uh, unique stories about failures of the digital bugle. And I always like to say, well, I'm not going to fail. I want to get through the last note if I miss them all. Raleigh Salmon's family reached out to Larry when their beloved 90-year-old father passed away. It was very special to know that there was someone that was, you know, just able to just come out and provide his services, you know, for, you know, just to, to honor Grandpa.